Hello, welcome to the MindTrack.net server. I'm currently in the starboard nacelle of the Enterprise C build. In my last video, I misidentified the guy who was working on the bazaar dumps. Um, the guy who's currently working on these, and the guy who was working on them beforehand, is iPanic C14 or iPanic14. Uh, just want to make that clarification and correction. And past this, I want to give you an update on what we've done. If I can get my trusty old fly mode to work. I went ahead and lowered this aft section of the hangar so it can accommodate a larger ship or shuttle or runabout whatever we decide to park back here. Additionally, uh, Lou Paulus and I, uh, Lou Paulus came on the server while I was in the process of working on this and he helped me finish it. The navigational computer is ready to be mirrored and set up and we did some interim interior work here. I appreciate his help in laying out these corridors. So there's a few of them that are done. Not too many though. Yeah. And with his help we identified a pretty good spot for it and I'm pretty excited. Yep. Enterprise C. Believe it or not, we gotta go one more up here. Do we? Yeah, yes we do. Now has a pool. Look at that. I call this the Lupulus pool, but he says no. <laughs> Anyways, um, nice little pool area for the crew to take a quick swim around. Since the ship does not have hollow suites. Uh, it has to have open areas like garboretums, rec rooms, pools, it'll even, at some point I'll stick a bowling alley somewhere on it as well, maybe even a tennis court. Just some places for the crew to kick back and relax. And past that, that's pretty much all the uh, current work that's been done on her. Uh, more attention is being put on towards the D. show you uh, what I did with her if I can stop staring at a blue screen here. Sometimes I go too fast and chunk loading errors occur. There we go. That's what we want to see. Sort of. <laughs> uh, we want to go this way. Yes, I do have OptiFind installed. It's just the nature of the beast with these servers being so big. There's a lot of information here. I'd also like to announce that uh, one of the guys that's helping me with the C build has been promoted. I panic. He has uh, been bumped up a rank, I believe. Uh, congrats to him. Uh, I believe he'll be taking over responsibilities um, that um, some of the other members have had to uh, to uh, delegate, so delegate away. Anyways, here it is. This is what I've been working on for the Enterprise D, the medical complex. This is the uh, Probert. This is the actual medical complex out of the D. That's the main medical complex built by Blue Goblin and I believe I Panic, and it's located in the secondary hall. It's the one you see on the show. This one we never see on the show, but it is in the blueprints, and this is it, you know, and a work in progress. So over here we have our isolation ward, and. Both uh, iPanic and Patchy Patch helped me with this, kind of making it look like a, you know, an isolation ward. Forgive my spelling, I spell well. And this is the emergency ward. 
course this will have a roof on it because it'll be inside the ship and this is a general sick bay or something let's take a look here infirmary it's just the basic infirmary of course operating room right there and prep for the operating room and you know according to the plans that has gardens who might argue with the official plans this is a lab area and this is a office anywho that's pretty much it thanks again to blue goblin for the information on this it was a great help appreciate it uh, hopefully um, get some more work done on it get the gardens all fleshed out get these two side areas done and get it approved and put back into the into the D um, probably change the carpet to from red and blue to something a little bit more show based you know with trim work and eh, figure it out later and with that I appreciate you watching again this is the mindtrack.net server and have a good day